Hi, Natri. Hey, hi. Hi. We are here to give a quick question with you, Natri. Wow, hi. How, how are you all? Hi, we are doing great. How are you, Natri? I am okay, Alhamdulillah. Shall we working, begin, Natri? So, Natri, what's your morning routine like, Natri? My God, it is, you know, um, unpredictable, mm -hmm. exciting, <laughs> sometimes stressful. But uh, always happening. Come uh, on. If you have one superpower, uh, yeah. what would you do? Yeah. Dah you dah makan dah semua ni? Dah jumpa dah semua dah. Okay, okay. Boleh come my room? Yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Where do you want to sit? There? Anywhere, Nancy. Why do you sit there? Well, what were you saying? Just now? Uh, if you have one superpower, for me to have super power, mm -hmm. I would like to have a magic wand. <laughs> yeah. Magician. By the way, Tansi, happy ending or scary movie, Tansi? Definitely happy ending. By the way, Tansi, can you share with us what are your best physical features? Masha Allah. I don't think I have any. But maybe in any person, it's always a combination of all the of all the features. I, see. I don't think I don't think it's just about one. I see. Yeah. Interesting, Dan Jay. Yeah. If you could have any job, what would you want to do? I love my job. Uh, I mean, or rather, you know, I like what I'm doing now. I don't want any other job. I like being with people, yeah. especially women. Wow, Dan Jay, one country that you have not visited and willing to go. Ah, actually there are many countries I've not visited. I would love to go, but if you ask me, can I have two countries instead of one? Sure. <laughs> okay. Um, I would love to go to Palestine. You know, to see what is it all about. You know. And I would also like to go to Iceland. Actually. Wow. Yeah, I mean it's the other end of the world. It's completely different from what I've been reading. So I think if I can have these two countries, it would be really great. But I can't stand the cold. I see. Tansri, what is your shoe size? Uh, my shoe size? <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, I like, don't tell the world, but it's seven, okay? <laughs> yeah. By the way, Tansri, uh, do you cook? No! I have to confess, you know, I really can't cook. Nice. But if I have to, I will. Uh, that's wonderful, Tansi. Yeah. By the way, what is your poignant childhood memories? My poignant childhood memories? It's... so uh, I was in Penang. I was born in Penang and I grew up. I come from a big family, happy family. So it's about going to school, it's about being with my parents, my grandparents. And uh, it's about loving Penang as it then was. You know, like the Botanical Gardens, Georgetown, Chaurasta, going up the hills, the beach, the beach. Okay. Having friends from my school, you know, I was from Northern Road, St. George's, the food, the people. Also, I have to say, you know, uh, the diversity. I think it was a gentler society then. I see. You know, like, because I, it's a very cosmopolitan place, Penang, as it was then. So it was it was really meaningful, you know. I have many happy memories of my childhood. Then should we come to our last question, then we... So soon. <laughs> <laughs> if you could have breakfast with a historic figure, who would that person be and why, then she? <sighs> ah. Oh, that's tough because um, there are many people who inspire me, but I think I will, you know, I'll be realistic. I, I would love to have breakfast with my mom, my husband, and my kids and grandchildren now. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, thank you so much, Tansri, for your time. Good luck. Thank you, Tansri. And, and thank you for, for dropping in to see us. My God, you know. <laughs> this is a lovely surprise. Yeah. Have a great day, Tansri. Thank you.